Hey everybody, Johnny here. In this quick video, I wanted to give you an update on my new asset snapshot add-on for Blender. I had a contribution from user LJ3D adding a few extra features, like a side panel, to the add-on. Also, it appears the main problem I was having with an occasional crash has been fixed. So I wanted to give you a quick demo of what you can do with this plugin now. You can download the add-on from my GitHub page github.com slash johnnygizmo slash asset underscore snapshot. From the main page, simply click the code button and say download zip. From inside Blender, go to the edit menu, preferences, click install, go to the downloads folder, and choose your downloaded file. Click the checkbox to activate it, and you're ready to go. Now you'll see in your end panel, you've got an asset snapshot tab. Here you can set your preview resolution, and depending on whether you have a collection or an object selected, those two buttons will activate. So in this case, I've got a collection selected, so you see my button for Asset Snapshot Collection is activated. If I were to come in and select a particular object from this collection, you'd see now that both are selected. For this particular file, all of my assets are going to be collections. I've disabled all but one of my collections. I'll select my one I want to take a snapshot of, and press Asset Snapshot Collection. I'll zoom in a little bit and try again. That looks pretty good. I'm going to go through the remaining items in this file and create their snapshots. And there you have it. 15 custom previews, pretty easily done. And now with no crashes. So check out the plugin, give it a test run, see how it works for you. Leave me a comment down below and let me know how it works. Thanks for watching the video. Make sure to subscribe. I'll see you next time.